What's the defensive end? Oh, Hassan Reddick. I gotta put Hassan Reddick. How many have 16 sacks? No, they say look good, feel good, play good, you heard? You know, he's he's kind of this tweener guy, right? He's 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 a little bit of a backer, he's a little bit of a defensive end, but he can do it all. And knocked away by Reddick. Uh, but I'll tell you this, he's 100% of a pass rusher. Including playoffs, Hassan Reddick had 19 and a half sacks. No matter what game we're playing, you know, Hassan is gonna get his. I think he should be in that defensive player of the year category. I think he's one of the best pass rushers in this league. Well, he's a guy that comes off the edge with tremendous burst, you know, four or five speed. <laughs> He has a quick jab, a hop out move that he gets a lot of tackles at lean with. I've seen him have a lot of sacks off that this year. One thing that I say he do better than anybody in the league is when he get to the quarterback, he going for the ball. He's not just going for the sack. Lawrence straight back. Lawrence looks. Lawrence hit. He fumbles the football, and I believe the Eagles have it. They do. They do. Hassan Reddick made the hit. Fields back, he's hit, and the football is loose. Prescott back again, he's hit, and it is ready. I'm a big Hassan Reddick fan, huge fan. And uh, if you watch his film, he's he been winning rushes all year, and he's been going for the ball. He finished fourth in the voting for NFL Defensive Player of the Year. My favorite play from last year, I would have to say, was the sack in the first playoff game against the Giants. And they're gonna go for it on fourth and eight. Because it was a tone setter, it kind of got the energy going, and it set a standard for what that game was going to look like. Eight hit. Hassan Riddick, that's another sack. You know, I think that set the momentum for the rest of our playoff push and going into the Super Bowl. We said we ain't going nowhere yet, baby. Another opportunity. The NFC Championship. This is the type of game where things are gonna get heated. Brock Purdy. The ball got hit. Hassan Reddick. I just talked to Brock Purdy on our podcast, and I got a lot of respect for that kid, but, I mean, that play solidified that game early. He just gets hammered by Hassan Riddick. And I'm sure Haas was not intending to hurt, but when you're getting hits on a quarterback as frequently as he does, stuff like that happens, and that's got to be the standout moment from him from last year. You can't block him with a tight end. You can't block him with a tight end. Like, blocking him with a tight end, he, he got clean fast. And once you see that hand go back and just get the ball off. This time, they're trying to block him with Croft, the tight end. Stop blocking good rushes with a tight end. It's never going to work. Let's go! Last year was a really big year, but I'm now entering my prime, so. You know, while last year was good and I think I deserve to be on the, on the list, you know, let's see what we do this year. I think I'll be on there again.